Arriwa. What are you doing here? I have a message from Paris. Shh. Come tell me. How did you learn to ride? Oh, I didn't. Oh, hurts a lot, actually. What does Paris say? She says you will be betrayed. We should go, now. If we leave the talks, we are assured of war. She trapped it, Mama. She seemed very sure. Paris's premonitions might come true, but if we walk away, thousands of people will die. That is a certainty. Mama. Your mother will handle our business. We will stay close in case this betrayal does come to pass. Thank you. She's been wrong before. Paris or Mom? Both. It's good you came. Find a perch, keep watch. Okay. Hard to talk about borders when your government has repeatedly re-knotted the surveyor's maps, claiming Pyan territory as your own. To be clear, is that a formal accusation? It's a fact. I know that voice. That's Ren, the woman who saved us in Trevantes. Sounds like you're happy to see her. I am. It's always the hard way with you. If this was a Forgot to mention you were Pyan royalty. <laughs> I would have if I had known. You didn't know. It's a long story. Well, you'll have to tell me sometime. Every day since I escaped, I've dreamed of seeing you again. I know this is difficult. Our nations are about to go to war. Not if this conference is successful. It won't be. You can't know that. Can you? And if our people go to war, you will fight for yours, and I will fight for mine. You just can't let that happen, Ren. I know my mother doesn't want war. I'm not sure there can be peace between our people. And I don't want to fight you. Fight you. 